Buongiorno. I'm Jed with Italy Wise here in beautiful Imperia on the coast of Liguria. And in this episode, we are going to be talking about one of Liguria's most revered culinary treasures, and that is Farrenata di Ceci. Stay tuned. My first up close and personal experience with this savory dish began about 30 minutes inland and in the home of our welcoming host, Roberto and Loredana, who are already hard at work. Roberto stoking the coals for the wood-fired oven. Chopped green onions were ready. The batter of chickpea flour and water whipped up one last time. Both were added to a large boiled nettle dish. The contents were stirred for even distribution. Then came Roberto's long, careful slide deep into the oven's most intense heat. The last touch of the coals, then constant vigilance as the farranata began to cook and bubble. Careful rotation to ensure even cooking. A quick check for doneness. It's looking pretty damn perfect now. A last check. And the verdict is... A thumbs up from Roberto, and into the house she goes. Wine is poured, and the feast begins with stuffed zucchini flowers and a savory torta. Meanwhile, Loredana cuts the farinate into pieces. Now, now look at this part, next part. Look at the underside and how perfectly cooked this is. Now, this traditional Ligurian dish is served with that embellishment other than cracked black pepper. And that's Bulconcini di Cinghiali, that's morsels of wild boar, slow cooked and served over polenta with plenty of gravy. Yours truly had two giant helpings. Then came a tray of sinful sweets and a delicious fruit torta. Happiness was an ample supply. Coffee capped this amazing feast. Grazie mille, Roberto and Loredana.